Tinkercad friends, today I got a fun one. We have got a SimLab project that never ends, so let's get cracking. Today we're going to start on Thingiverse. Friends, this was created by Tulio back in 2016. I printed it in my classroom. It has a mechanism where it uses this to bring the balls back up and it never ends, and it was amazing. Took 18 hours to print, absolutely loved it, but now I wanted to make it work in Tinkercad Sim Lab. So step one was to download the files. If you go to the files, there is the track, the spiral, and the turn cap, and the lop cap. I could not get the spiral to work, so all I did was bring in the track. Notice it's only two megabytes, so actually it came into Tinkercad rather easily. So right here you can see my working one, but let's actually find the parts that make it work. An easy way is to visit the gallery, and under staff picks, if you scroll down just a little ways, you will find the ball return with motor. So when you click on this, it is set to copy and tinker, so don't forget the golden rule of Tinkercad. Give a reaction before you copy and tinker. So if you have not checked this out yet, it is amazing. It uses a sweet little part that is a bucket that has a peg, and then this spins around and it dumps them. Now if you want to watch, you can simply click up here to enter the sim lab. You have to wait a moment for the geometry, but then when you hit play, you can see that it moves all the way around with the balls gently falling in. This has got a nice angle so that it catches them, and it is so darn slick. It's got this shape to help it keep the chain the way you want, and this goes on and on and on forever. So, of course, I want to use this mechanism in my own designs, so I'm just going to simply click and delete all the parts that I don't need. And now I can start importing parts to make my own awesome marble run. Before I do that, though, I am going to make the world much larger. I'm going to make this 633 by 433. Bingo. All right, friends, so this is my contraption. You can see that I've got two ways for the balls to keep continuing. If we switch to SimLab, once again, you will be able to perfect this. I have got it so that it works reasonably well, and I'm looking forward to seeing what kind of modifications you can come up with. So once in SimLab, we can simply hit play, and then the balls will start moving down, or marbles if you want to call them that. You can see this is the extra catch. If they fall out of here, they may get caught on this one. They're just starting to come down the ramp. There goes number one. It worked like a champ. Here comes number two. Bingo. This was just trial and error. You can see that one. Hey, it actually got caught and worked. This one, is it going to work? <laughs> hot diggity that is a lot in a row but as you can see they are piling up so there is room for it to be made better so everybody there is the original version as i said it is set to copy and tinker and ready for you to modify don't forget the golden rule of tinkercad before you copy and tinker give a reaction just another reminder, if you ever tag your items with HLMT23, of course, I will check them out and I will give you a reaction. A Sweet House by the Donut King. We've got a Working Mixer by the Donut King. And we had somebody asking for ideas. Very cool. Check out this Federation Warship. Oh my gosh. And a Federation Heavy Carrier. If you guys submit stuff, I will always check them out. Friends, of course, have a glorious day and keep tinkering. Friends, as I wrap up, I do want to remind you about my website, hlmodtech.com. Of course, I've got a tab dedicated to Tinkercad with all sorts of amazing categories. Below that, you'll find the day one favorites, the useful starters, and the Tinkercad essentials. If you scroll down a little farther, you will find my course, Tinkercad in 20 Days. It is fully explained in this video. Of course, I do want to highlight the coupon code 25HLTinkerCAD as it'll get you 25% off any of the awesome courses at cadclass.org. Of course, you can get there by simply clicking this link.
Friends, just a quick reminder about the sweet built-in messaging tool. You can click that button, add your question, comment, or suggestion, and reach me almost instantly. You can also use the link to the Tinkercad Community Discord. As you can see, there are a boatload of members, and it's a fantastic place to talk everything Tinkercad. Finally, friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.